in this video I show you how to do disk stylus with roller datumin. Measure the length of the roller with a micrometer and note. This length will be its uh, diameter. Click on the probe datumin button. Uh, this will bring up the probe status window. Select the first probe position. Enter length and the stylus diameter and the top of the probe status. For MH20i probe head, usually the probe length plus 20 millimeters. Now click on the add button. Uh, now use the selected stylus to take a minimum of 5 points of the reference bow. Points must be taken close to the equator of the reference sphere, so that is the spherical surface on the disc that touches, but not uh, the sharp corner of the disc. If you are not happy with any point that you have taken, you can erase the last point taken by clicking on the Retake button or erase all of the points taken by clicking on the Clear button. When you have completed the fifth point and this position, the following prompt will appear. If the offset previously measured relate uh, to the previous stylus, click on Yes. If the offset previously measured relate to the current stylus and uh, you wish to keep them, click on No. Uh, the diameter of the disks that can be edited by clicking on the entry in the prop status window and selecting edit. Uh, select stylus position 2. Edit the ball diameter on stylus position 2 so it matches the length previously measured. Click on the add button and uh, take about 10 points using the spherical form on the bottom of the roller. Edit roller diameter. When a proposition has been successfully datumed, the information about the probe will be transferred to the central white area. When you have finished with the probe datuming window, click OK and uh, this will bring you back to the main screen. It is now possible to toggle through the two stylus positions by clicking on relevant position. 
and now we can start measuring.